the whole concept, I wanted to introduce Singaporeans something new, something interesting, something they're not very familiar with. Hi, my name is Keith. I'm the founder of Let and Dad. I'm 29 this year and I've been doing this for about four years. Let and Dad offers pretty traditional British cuisine. Most of our items are pub grub, so we wanted to incorporate that in a hawker to introduce to fellow Singaporeans. Before I started Land Dad, I was actually working in the UK. I was working in a restaurant and bar in a hotel. Land Dad came about when I was discussing this idea. I was bouncing off ideas with my dorm mates who were mostly British. They said, oh, so what's the story behind it? I might want to do something with my dad, get him involved. So they said, oh, your lad with your dad, why not just come up with a name that has a good ring to it? It was very important for me because, I mean, being a student in a foreign country, especially in London, eating out was very expensive. So I got a couple of recipes from my mom, started working in the restaurant, it's where I met other chefs, and then got the whole concept of the British cuisine that I wanted to do in Singapore. That's when I started applying for culinary courses. In fact, the first time I came back and let my mom try it, she said that it's not acceptable because uh, Singaporeans have a more complex taste bud. We expect more flavour, more umami, that kind of thing. So we incorporated some local flavours in there. You know, in a hawker centre, our prices are kept at $10. And if you go to a cafe or a restaurant, there's no way you can find this kind of food at this kind of prices. Today, we'll be doing our signature beef stew. So our beef stew is actually slow-cooked for eight hours. We serve it with homemade mashed potatoes. So our mashed potatoes, we use actual butter, no margarine, no fillers, no powder, nothing. It goes perfect with the tender beef chunks and gravy. Hawker has always been something that I'm very familiar with. So I grew up having hawker fare on a very regular basis. Convenient, it's affordable and you have a good choice. When I was studying there, one of the things I missed the most other than my friends, my family, was actually the hawker centres. Because I couldn't get that kind of options in the UK. The second dish would be uh, our fish and chips. So unlike all the other coffee shops and hawker stalls, we use haddock. We source for Atlantic haddock and we do it in our own house-made batter. So our fish and chips is not breaded but battered. Crispy on the outside, soft on the inside. And we serve it with straight cut chips as well as a homemade mushy peas. Lastly would be bangers and mash. Our sausages are fresh pork sausage, so it is actually finely minced pork in actual sausage casing. We always want our customers to feel that the food is worth the price. So when they come here, they have quality food at affordable prices. So we want them to feel, oh, I'm going land that to have a very hearty meal and I don't have to break the bank.